Hello everyone, in this video we'll see how to create a client proxy using the proxy generator for Visual Studio 2008. The first thing you have to do is open the SAP Explorer 2008 tool window from the tools menu. Okay, let's assume that this is your first time using this tool, so we have to add a new application server to the Explorer. The Add New Application Server window pops up. In this window, you'll have to complete all your application server information in order to connect. Please notice that all your connection information will be encrypted in a local file. If everything went OK, you'll have a new entry now for your application server. So the next step is to create a new project in Visual Studio or to open an existing one. In this sample we will browse for a function module. Uh, in order to do this we'll create a new filter. Let's call it custom RFCs. And choose the seed test at two values function a very simple one if you right click on the selected node uh, you'll have a menu with different options you can create for example RFC client or server uh, we'll go with the client now and after a few seconds our proxy will be generated following with the sample let's say that we want to call the remote function on when the user clicks the button. We can use the proxy usage snippet feature to write less code. So we now have to paste the code snippet from the clipboard and replace the connection string attributes and pass the proper parameters to the remote function. Okay, so after calling the remote function, we want to show a little message to the user with the result. Now we press F5 to see how it works. Okay, and there we go, we have our proxy up and running. Okay, that would be all. Thank you for your time and for further information. Please visit Aconcagua IT's site.